bit of a delay. Let it catch up. Looks like um, cantaloupe me is a couple seconds ahead. So that we can, of course, forgive. Looks like we got some people in chat here. We got Deep Head Danny. We got 4 is Steven, 4i Steven, and Puke 7. Welcome to um, the very uh, impromptu second race between Cantaloupe Me and Random Effect. And Cantaloupe Me making exceedingly speedy work of 1 1. That, that, is, that is professional right there. Unbelievably professional. We can only imagine how the rest of the race will go with the cantaloupe me just uh, make, making everything, as I said in the first race, butter smooth. Maybe the quality isn't butter smooth, but the gameplay is exceptional and random effect. Trying to catch up. Anything is possible at this point. You know, one, one wrong move could completely change the uh, outlook of this game. Maybe uh, one of them uh, faces an Elmira driver. Still possible. We saw it in the last race. Random Effect nearly taking a dip there, but manages to avoid it. And uh, what's this? Did Cantaloupe me actually take a hit from Elmira? I don't know. I missed it. I was uh, looking over at Random Effect. That's unbelievable! Random Effect has taken the lead! Look at this exceptional gameplay! Extravagant! At this point, we've already had a lead change, and we're only in stage 1-2. Now, 1-3. Cantaloupe Me has some serious catching up to do, but like I said in the last race, it's not over until that bell rings. And uh, Random Effect is uh, kind of taking his time being extremely cautious, but uh, who knows, maybe this is the race where Slow and Steady wins. Maybe trying to um, beat the clock rather than beating the opponent could really uh, put Cantaloupe Me in danger. And uh, hopefully he won't take another uh, Elmira driver to the face along with the rest of his body. There we go. Playing it safe. Uh, very good choice. Random effect, though, being a little too um, being a little too overzealous there, taking a hit from one of those rats. Dang. Uh, did the post game commentary come through to your stream? It did. It came through, and so you do not need to worry about that. That's why I, I kind of stayed quiet while the two of you talked. You were basically your own post-game commentary, so don't worry about that. It came through. I eventually cut it so that I could set up this uh, set up this stream, and uh, so far so good. We have both people in the, now the same level. And Cantaloupe Me has uh, kind of uh, careened across Random Effects' lead and is now facing Dr. Gene Splicer, but doesn't get the one, two, three. Kind of gets a 1, and then the 2-3. Random effect, another death, a game over! Sending him all the way back, essentially almost like an Elmira driver, but an even bigger insult. Come on, random effect. He's got to pick up his shoes, pull, his, pull up his bootstraps and his shoes somehow, and continue on with the race. Never give up, trust your instincts, do a barrel roll, do not fall into the pits. I cannot stress that enough. Cantaloupe Me is just making his way through stage two. And uh, wow, takes a hit, but luckily has the safety heart. Something very important to keep in mind. You could try to simply just boost your way through the entire level, but sometimes it really pays off to stop and collect the safety heart. They don't call it a safety heart for nothing. I was just waiting for that nope nope from Concord Condor. And we can't we can't just assume that Random Effect has already lost the race. Like I said before, it's anybody's race until that very final dot done. Who knows, maybe uh, maybe Cantaloupe Me faces uh, trials and tribulations in one of the later levels. Maybe a very late Elmira driver, possibly in the fourth world. Maybe Random Effect uh, encounters some uh, better RNG from some of these enemies. 
and manages to make up for lost time. Anything is possible, which is what I appreciate about this game. Maybe takes a different strategy. Maybe we'll see a dizzy devil. Who knows? Uh, D Pat Danny says, We've seen some crazy back and forth this season, no doubt about that. And we have a beef a curry. He said, I looked away. What happened to Random? Um, a lot has happened to Random Effect. Unfortunately, he suffered at the hands of the enemies of this game and got a game over. And Cantaloupe Me is just, just moving along at this point, just keeping pace. Tries to uh, jump over those poles, but uh, kind of missed one there. So he's taking kind of a more scenic route, a slower route, but still the top route, which is definitely the recommended route. Taking the lower route, it just eats up time. And time is something uh, that is not on your side in these races. I mean, it's a race. The idea is not only to beat the clock, but also beat your best, get a PB, get a personal best, and also defeat your opponent at the same time. But random effect, oh no, trying to jump over that uh, over that little pit, but jumps too high and ends up with a rat to the face. Hopefully uh, he has, uh, you know, gotten all his shots. And Cantaloupe me already on Pirate Gideon time. This is, uh, this is... Uh, Unbelievable at this point. Just Cantaloupe Me is in is in great form now. He did take an early death, but I think uh, that was just again just kind of washing away, uh, you know, the the problems, kind of getting the fingers limber. And random effect, another game over. Oh, shake my head. That is an SMH moment right there that he may regret, because Cantaloupe Me is making his way to three one and. Random effect is just, at this point, distraught. We're stuck on the continue screen. I'm hoping he hasn't already given up. Because I'm, I'm sitting here, I'm hoping that this isn't the end for both players. Come on, random effect. Continue the game. Keep it up. Do not forfeit. I don't know, I may have to even check um, speedruns live to see if there was a forfeit, because to, to remain on the continue screen this long is certainly a little disconcerting. But Cantaloupe Me, not even phased by any of this, still just continuing the game, just uh, maybe trying to get maybe trying to get a personal best. Because, I mean, SRL, that's a great place for that sort of thing. You can race against yourself, which at this point it seems Cantaloupe Me, that's all he's doing. Uh, Random Effect says, I hate this and don't want to play. Oh, that is unfortunate. <laughs> and uh, Random Effect in chat. Sorry, guys, I hate this game. Oh, Random Effect. I was cheering you on that you wouldn't give up. I was hoping and praying and sending my thoughts and prayers to you that you could continue this, but no. Oh, I am crestfallen. Random effect. Oh, dear. Well, yeah, pumpkins can... Well, they, they can do something. Uh, yeah, random effect was ahead at one point. Uh, beef curry is correct. And cantaloupe me is just moving along. Just continuing along. Just um, not worrying about uh, the stakes. He wants to see this through. Now, random effect, I also don't want to, you know, uh, take you down... I mean, right now I'm having problems, so I can't really go into um, into the Discord uh, chat right now because all you would hear is pretty much empty air, but uh, hopefully you're watching the stream. Pumpkins can do something. Yes, they can. Four eyes, Steven. They can do something. That's definitely true. Cantaloupe me, furball in World uh, 3, making wonderful progress. <laughs> What more can I say? Cantaloupe Me is pretty much textbook speedrunning this. You know, making all the uh, right decisions. Random effect, though, remaining on that continue screen is kind of just a reminder of just how honestly difficult this game is. I mean, random effect, you know what? I, I can't really blame random effect. There were points where I thought to myself, well, I could just end it right here, but 
Uh, let's see. Random Effect says, no, all good. I practiced for maybe five or six hours, beaten it a few times with save states. Now, that is something to, uh, to commend, the fact that you put that much effort into it. So, it's a shame to, uh, to see you bow out so early, but that's just how it is. Oh, okay, Kanta has been playing this for a long time. Indeed, he has. It shows in the gameplay. It really was a David versus Goliath, but, uh, you know, sometimes a sling just isn't enough. But Random Effect, just the fact that you showed up, you participated, does show a lot. You know, you, um, despite the fact that you hate this game and uh, you you extremely dislike pumpkins for uh, obvious uh, lewd reasons, you, you showed up, you came to play, and you did. And just the fact that you did that, you know, it's enough It's enough for me. I mean, you're facing someone like Cantalobi who's put tons and tons of time into this. So, what do we say? What is this? Random effect has started again? What's this? Joking, this game is rough to wrap your head around. Brutal game. It is. It definitely is. And, uh, has Random Effect started again? Is this Random Effect we're seeing? Could this be a resurrection? As you can see, Cantaloupe me taking a death. The Russian is cut, ladies and gentlemen. The Russian is cut. This man is vincible. That's not invincible, but quite vincible. So it is possible the cantaloupe me its imperfections are starting to show through. Um, did he dot forfeit? I, I don't think I saw it. Uh, you know what? Let me quickly check. Oh, he has indeed forfeited. Random effect has forfeited from the race. So indeed, that is the case. That is unfortunate. So it's pretty much over. He has officially forfeited. This is official. Officially, official, official. This game looks like fun to run. It is fun. I still really like the game. D-Pad Danny says, it's a good speed game, but rough. Random Effect says, but I playing. I, he's, uh, he also says, I've been playing for two weeks. I did. It may look all cute, but like the bunny in Holy Grail, it's a killer. <laughs> Akarasi, very good. I'm not sure if that's how you pronounce your name. I'm really trying here. But according to um, according to Speedruns Live, he has indeed forfeited. But he's still playing the game. That shows extra dedication to SRL. Uh, clearly, Random Effect um, thinks that uh, you know his, his skills are not uh, necessarily up to his opponents, so he forfeited. So, but the pressure's off now. So now he can just uh, play play as he feels, enjoy the game, be a little more casual, a little more open, a little more free flowing. Now that the pressure is off, maybe he'll even play better. Who knows? But Cantaloupe me taking on Danky Kang, taking down Danky Kang. Random is doing it for us, the fans. See, Beef Curry's got the right idea. Beef Curry knows what's up. And what is up is we're still seeing this game. It's still going on. Random Effect is now just playing for the fun of it, which is really what the SHI tournament is about. Random Effect ought to be the bloody mascot at this point. Because this is showing just the pure fun that is the tournament. I know it's a tournament, and you want to win, and winning feels good, and to be the ultimate winner is very nice, to be the ultimate loser, not so nice, but we're here for the fun, and that's the, my favorite part, honestly, and Cantaloupe Me having a wacky fun time in Wacky Land, just steamrolling these levels, but not necessarily without, you know, bumps and bruises and little scratches. I mean, sure, it looks like he's just uh, breezing through Wacky Land, you know, like he's blindfolded. But, um, you know, he has take, he has made mistakes, so this game is not, is overall not easy. No matter how easy one may make it look, there is skill involved, serious skill. And look, Random Effect just blasted through the first world. We're having a good time here. We're here to watch, Akarasi says, we're here to watch some stuff, absolutely.
and uh, Random is doing it for the fans, all four of them. I have enjoyed my first season, that's Deep Hat Danny saying that. And I'm glad, because I say, the more the merrier. I'm glad people are having fun, having a good time. When people say, I hate this, this is terrible, I wish I wasn't doing it. It just, oh, it just hurts me right in the hearts. Yes, I have multiple hearts, maybe I'm a time lord. How the hell is Kanta getting that speed all the time? It's, it's the, uh, it's the ducking jump. It's, it's the slide jump. When you slide, you do pick up a little bit of speed, but then you slow down. But as long as you keep ducking, uh, no pun intended, you keep that, you keep up that pace. I think it might be like a game glitch or something. So if you jump as you duck, that speed remains. And Buzz Thunder, uh, Buzz Thunder coming in with a booming phrase. <laughs> and, uh, 4 I Steven says he is good at every game. Um, Cantaloupe Me is good at many games, but, uh, like I, like I said earlier, we have, we have seen him, uh, the man can bleed. So, but look at Random Effect, just almost effortlessly now making his way through the water level. We saw him take a few deaths in the water level, and yet, here we are, because the pressure's off. And you can just sit back, enjoy the game in its most purest and greatest form. I believe we're almost actually done here because Candelope me on the final level. Montana Max. See if he can make it through in one go as Random Effect trying to avoid Elmira. Elmira has been a real stickler in these last two uh, matches. You know, uh, take, taking some uh, real lead changes. Uh, you get hit by Elmira, that could be a whole lead change all on its own. For the better, for the worse, it's really up to who gets uh, slammed. And get slammed. Very nice. Very nice choice of words on the Gideon time. You're getting a little hoarse here. <laughs> uh, D pad says, I'll be racing Cantaloupe again. Hashtag rematch. You hear that? And the Buzz Thunder uh, waving, waving to the crowd. Um, very, uh, very interesting uh, choice of words as he entered. And Cantaloupe trying to make his way up of this. Uh, up this little conveyor belt type area seemed to pose a little bit of difficulty for him but not too much and hashtag team d-pad says buzz thunder well we know where his allegiance lies and uh we know that montana max's allegiance lies with himself cantaloupe me taking a very early hit uh right in uh montana's face but he manages to get him one time gets him two more times and then we can call this a day there's one but oh no cantaloupe me taking a death going all the way back to the beginning of the level Technically, this is already Cantaloupe's uh, game one, because uh, Random Effect uh, has affectionately um, forfeited. But as we can see here, you know, he's already taking on Pir uh, Random Effect is already taking on Pirate Gideon time. And um, wouldn't this be something if Random Effect managed to catch back up? It would be it would be so tragic, though, if uh, can't if uh, Random Effect managed to catch all the way back up. But then that forfeit, unfortunately, remains. SRL is law, and, um, you know, the, ma the match is already technically a um, game set and match. This is more, this is more uh, pleasantries and, uh, you know, pleasuries, as it were. Uh, Random Effect says I'd still forfeit. <laughs> well, I'm just glad that you're still going forward here, that you're still going ahead. As Cantaloupe me trying his hand again at Montana Max, and he's about to make his way to the boss. Uh, that last climb is trolly. He's got to be mad about that. Right, you are, Deep Head Danny. Close one on the money back cannons. Money back cannons. I like that name. That's pretty good. Or your money back. Wow, very close on those um, punches. Feeling a bit uh, punchy, punchy. And now, uh, Cantaloupe Me is, uh, those punches are rather desynced from each other. So this is, this is very harrowing. But Cantaloupe Me finally takes down Montana Max. And we can now put a fine, we can put a pretty bow on the end of this. As hopefully we will see, uh, the, the prostate, uh, exam that Montana Max so righteously deserves for being a real jerk. And, uh, practically kidnapping Babs Bunny. Rabbit napping, you might say. There it is! There we go. 
It took Kanta a long time to get that third hit. It did. It was scary. Indeed. GG to both players. I mean, Random Effect had uh, faced some real uh, difficulties there. Cantaloupe Me faced some difficulties of his own. I mean, even though he may uh, be the clear winner here, he was not without fault. So it is comforting to know that even the best of players can have their trials and tribulations. What was time? Uh, I don't know because I wasn't running my timer because uh, I had some difficulty with it. But I did manage to get the time on the first one, but it was definitely not, a, I don't, I'm assuming it was not a PB for Cantaloupe Me. Sorry about that, Deep Head Danny. Dragonfire42669. Uh, welcome to the stream. You're seeing the tail end here. Whether it be a duck tail, a buddy tail, or a, a Tasmanian devil tail. I would go into uh, the Discord chat, but unfortunately... Oh, there we go. Yeah, SRL. Perfect. Um, yeah. I would uh, go into the Discord, but unfortunately, okay, I've been playing around with my audio settings all day, trying to make things better. Instead, I made them completely worse. And if uh, Armageddon is still broadcasting this, thank you so much. But I got, I got to do some things to prep for it. It's going to be on Speedruns Live. So if you got some time, check it out. I'm doing Zelda 1 and Zelda 2 double 100% back to back. It'll be a good watch. So I got to get ready for that. So I will see you all then. We're hearing some promo. I think from from Cantaloupe Me, that was very nice. Thank you so much for um, racing a wonderful race. I will exit this so that we don't have to see any more bloody ads from Xbox. <laughs> and Random Effect, Zelda 1 and Zelda 2, Craigasm. I agree on the Zelda 2. Not much of a fan of Zelda 1, though. But um, on that note, thank you, everybody, for coming to an, an unexpected double header. From D Pat Danny and Puke Seven, D Pat Danny taking the victory and Cantaloupe Me versus Random Effect. Cantaloupe Me taking the victory after Random Effect forfeited after uh, uh, a rather difficult time with this game. But come on, it's Tiny Toon Adventure. It's difficult. That's just how it is. But he came to play. You came to watch. I came to commentate. Thank you all so much for showing up. This is Armageddon time. Stay tuned. We're not done this tournament yet. Still lots more competition to come at you. So thanks again. Um, Deep Head Denny says thanks for the restreams. Thank you so much for showing up. And I will see you all next race.